to what? The Soul Soldier Museum. Soldier Museum, yeah. Where's the entrance? I'm just reading this. Go check and see. Right now. Why? Yeah, no need to open up the door so I should find. Well, it has a lot of miniatures in it made of every kind of material you can think of, cool. sought out, and bought throughout the world. Okay. Well, I'll hold that real for you then. Sure. Right. You can look through the gift shop anytime. Okay, well, that's what we're going to see what we can find. <laughs> I didn't notice these has, uh, had eyes on them yesterday. Oh, caterpillars. Cool. Yes. When I was throwing them on the floor. What are you doing? Filming. Cool. It says darn Yankee and it's a Confederate soldier, but you turn around and it says darn rebel and it's a Union soldier. Where do we look around at? Just right here. Look so. cute. It's a pencil sharpener. Less than six dollars. That was fifty-five cents. Fifty cents. A stretch penny collector book. What's that? You Must put, be this. Yeah, you get those. Confederate money. I always explain to my groups we're all going down together and we're all coming back up. That'd be cool. Got his broken dress. Got a filled map. I mean, there's a lot of things this, on, this, on these stores are all Confederate stuff. Probably there's more people up here from here than people way down south. And they probably can get up on Union and stuff. Going to another museum or something?
we'll start right over here with an introduction. If anyone has a camera, it can be used. And we're in The first room is artifacts from the Vikings to the Persian Gulf War. Then you get down a few steps to your left and you'll walk through a life-size Confederate encampment. The encampment is a nighttime scene.